Welcome to Fuga Party, the series where we build maps for each other to complete. Uh, the theme for today is Escape, and we'll begin with Bubbles map. Let's get into it. Oh my god, is it Fuga's temple? Remember when you went back in time to prevent Rumak from becoming a Ramax too early? So this is a perfect recreation of the Fuga's temple of this specific moment. You need to escape and get, get back to your time machine. So Fuga's Maybe. eyes are facing that direction because reasons. But oh, oh that's... Hold up. I yeah, want to I mean, see this in action. The time may be frozen, but Fuga... Okay, this is very... Is the this, God. Looks, this looks very cursed. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I could have just dropped down here. That was completely unnecessary. Okay. So, uh, oh, there's no sand here, so this is not actually an uh, accurate representation. Okay, but mm -hmm. we need... Okay, I can't go there because you placed blocks, but... Okay, there's this, which it has a iron shop door, and it has an invisible wall because reasons. So... And if I try to go there, I'm assuming it wouldn't work. So maybe it's not the exact Okay, replica. so there's like a, something suspicious going on under Fuga. But I don't oh, know I wouldn't recommend you messing with Fuga because... I'm not messing Whatever with... Fuga is doing, uh, you can't... Okay, so there are barriers in the A for some reason. Uh, the reason is because... It's, it's gonna be sand is gonna be placed there in the future. Not not in the future, but relatively to you. So okay, you can't go into that space because you will break the space-time continuum. Okay, so let's do this annoying parkour that I never play tested. No, I did it with like second try, so it is your own. Parkour well, I also did it with with. like in a second try. Okay. So, I can go closer to Fuga, which, but you said not to mess with Fuga, so I'm not gonna do that, I mean, you that, will obviously. have to mess with Fuga, but not right now. Okay, so here's you. I mean, uh, do you want a hint or do you want to sure. spend some more time? Yeah. So the hint is, I told you that it's an exact replica, but if you go back, it's not exactly the same, so maybe... You may recognize what's wrong with that room, what's not so accurate about uh, it. Okay, well, let, I'm gonna try to remember. Well, there was sand in this also room. Also, the globe looked just... Yeah, yeah, I, I, I okay. saw it, but... <laughs> yeah. whatever. I think, okay, there were, was sand. I think, like, it feels like it was longer, maybe. Also, I don't know if there were lanterns, but, like, I don't know, I'm, I don't remember. Yeah, I mean, you're, one too of well. the things that you said were right, so... Which one of them is helpful for you? The fact that it's shorter because I yes. don't know because so, there, there might be like a fake wall here. Somewhere. But not in I don't know this. It's not shorter in this direction though. It's shorter in this direction. Yeah, it is. Okay. F four blocks shorter in this direction, as you can see. Okay, so there's okay. I see. Okay, so there is a carrot. What so, do you do with a carrot? Give it to Fuga, obviously. That is correct. So do I put it in the chest or do I like drop it? I don't know. Oh, so that was Let correct. Fuga eat it. Oh! <laughs> now Fuga is well. op has opened its mouth. Uh, not eats, but... Uh, the Fuga's door. mouth. You, yeah, no, Fuga's, no, yeah, Fuga's pronouns no are Fuga's pronouns are Fuga. Yeah, Fuga opened Fuga's mouth. So now you can jump into it. Okay. But what are the pronouns of Fuga's mouth? Can you can you call <laughs> Fuga's mouth eat? Um, yes, because Fuga eats with it. That's the correct answer. You may be familiar with the game, uh, <laughs> which I forget the name of. <laughs> Basically, I am the narrator. Oh, I narrate... Stanley's Parable? Yes. Okay. I narrate this story, and you... And I'm not Fuga, by the way. I'm just a narrator, so... Don't think of me of some uh, godly creature. So let me help you get out. Romax goes into the main corridor. 
while. Well, Mike goes oh, into the main oh, corridor. Oh, okay, just magically He's open. a bit confused, but he goes into the door on you. his left. <laughs> okay, so I see what's going on. You're merging all of the themes for Fuga Party. That was that was a quest, and now it's choice. <laughs> so you said left, right? Romag thinks that he's smarter than the narrator, so he chooses the door on his right. He realizes that not a single container has anything of a value, so he goes into the door sure. on his left. I mean, <laughs> I don't know what doors. <laughs> okay, um, so this. He wait, hold up, hold up. I'm not going it. I wanna. Or, okay. Let's see this. Uh, by the way, don't, this is cheating, so don't oh, do the thing. Oh, that, that was cheating, okay. Yeah. So now, Ramax realizes not a single container has... A okay. Ramax thinks that doing everything... Okay, you want to do everything that I tell you to do, but in the reverse. So, you know what? Just don't jump there. Okay, don't jump there. Okay, I'm not gonna jump there. I'm gonna look around, surely there's like some other way, right? Ramax surely. really wants to do everything that I don't tell him to do. <laughs> sure, okay, whatever, I'm gonna jump. Wait, what? Oh no, I thought there was a barrier. So Ramax realizes that Okay, that was, that's, that was a terrible transition. I just like, oh my god, that's embarrassing. Ramax? This time, Ramax goes into the door on his left. Wait, I I heard an... There's a, like an amethyst sound. Ramax oh. is way too curious about what's on the other side. So he goes into his door on the right. He sees that there are plenty of pistons that are moving. And he tries to explore around. Okay, so we have... Random trapdoor. Okay, so that sounds. There must be a skulk sensor then, right? I guess. If that sound. Ramax, confused so. by what the sounds, tries to figure out where is the hidden skulk sensor that might not even exist anywhere around. Okay, so these trapdoors, what purpose do they even serve? Okay, wait. So, Ramax there's like hears a... a weird noise coming from the wall. So do I like, try to, I don't know, go through the wall or something, I don't know. Because I think it's inside this pillar. Yeah, Ramax okay. sees a weird amethyst block, so he tries to right-click it. He sees that he can push it, so he tries to hold shift to... Wait. I, I pull it, put it instead. Oh, okay. Now Ramax gets a sense of what mm -hmm. he can use this block for. Okay, wait, where was the wall? <laughs> okay. Ramax is doing the right thing. So he, with the first try, he goes and puts it on the pressure plate. Surely. He activates the pistons Wait, what? that reveal that Wait, there is up. an hole. Wait, what? Nothing happens. Ramax doesn't have high in high IQ, unfortunately. So he goes I mean, around the room to see oh. another amethyst block. He jumps in and realizes that he should have listened to narrator. Sure, okay, this whatever. This way, this time, he goes into the yeah, door yeah, on the yeah, left. Yeah. He sees his past memory of the future him teaching at Ramax's school. Incredible. Simply... He sees another block, so he tries to use it to so this... get up the ladder. Okay. Yeah, makes sense. Ramax realizes that maybe narrator is just trolling him because he's pissed off at him, not listening to what he says. Okay. So he goes into the door on his left, into the iron doors. He goes, he turns to the door on his right, where he just goes straight. 
into the iron doors. Oh. Mm -hmm. He gets himself trapped, so he just goes. Wait. He realizes that nothing is here, so he goes into the iron door. Surely, surely, there is absolutely nothing here. Yeah, absolutely nothing to be found anywhere. I don't think, I don't know what this is even for. Okay, let's, I guess, Ramax go. locking himself inside while narrator has to fix everything, goes and jumps off to go into another room. Wow. This time, Ramax is confused of where he should go, so he just goes where the god tell him to go. Yes. He goes into the rooms where he saw nothing and where he explored every single corner. Yeah, I just I just wanted to check because like maybe Ramax's just, brain is just maybe maybe a regular I, sized brain. Maybe I missed something. something. You okay. see, Ramax sees three Amethyst blocks immediately realizing what he needs to do with them. Okay, so there are pressure plates and this is locked. He uses leather for the amethyst like they have hands. Yes, surely. Okay, now that's... Remax tries to activate all of the pressure plates but then realizes that a specific combination of lights on and off should be placed. Wait, what? He realizes that what it means is not the exact number, but the spacing between the blocks. Spacing. Uh -huh. After getting an autism attack, he understands that two blocks should be together and one should be alone. Okay. Yes. Brute forces until he finds the right combination. Okay, and I don't know. Goes, I don't know what this means. If this even has a meaning, but okay. Wow. So the maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so now he goes and realizes that it was a dead end. So he just jumps off to get back uh, it okay, while you're saying this I'm gonna give myself saturation after being trapped in the back room Ramax goes back where he tries the only way he didn't succeed in so far okay so here I just fall right I think Ramax gets the right idea so he goes back oh Okay, Instead, he goes forward because he thinks that there is something hidden Wait, in this Bad? room. Oh, okay. Ramax so... returns to the classroom where he follows the iron doors. In this room, he saw a puzzle that he couldn't solve, so he tries to solve it again. Now, more familiar with how the blocks work. He thinks of a way that he can push this block. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Out. I, first, I forgot what does this do. Oh, this is does this. Okay. Ramax tries to squeeze the amethyst block under the. Yeah, you gotta push it one more time, man. Okay. Now he goes on the other side. There is a cleverly placed chair that he can use to. Oh, I can just do this, okay. So he pushes it up and then pulls it inside the okay. room. Reminds us into another room where he sees an opening, so he goes into that place. Okay, so I can jump up here and there's a pressure plate, so I can just Put a block there now. So will that work? I missed. 
Uh, wait, what? There's another one. Oh, I can just hold up. Oh. So I can pull it here and line. So there's a magma. Okay, so I can't pull it. Right? Oh, I can just. Oh, I can just jump across. I'm not succeeding then. So, wait, he can just exit. Surely he can just go and finish the map. Yeah, I'm not going there because. He goes into the teleporter and he wins the map. Okay, this was a really good map. The puzzles were supposed to be extremely easy. I was, I was, I was frustrated that you would complete this part in like five minutes because you could, we would just take the right path, solve the puzzles. Yeah, but like, in five I mean, seconds. it's it's easy to think they're easy when you design the, the puzzles, you know.